Hey there, Tater Tots! Welcome back. Wait a second. Where are we? Well, this is very different. Oh, look at the parrots. That's neat. <laughs> so this might look a little bit different than what you're used to seeing on Tater's World. The reason for that is we are starting a brand new series. That's right, a brand new series. And this one is hardcore, obviously, as you can see. Uh, but even more than that, uh, we're going to throw a little wrench in. And that little wrench works perfectly for the Caves and Cliffs update. You see, for this series, we are pretending to be a vampire. Obviously, I'm not doing that yet because I would be burning to death. Uh, so what are the rules <laughs> for this series? Um, the main rule, the main number one rule, is that we can't go outside at uh, during the day when the sun is out. Because obviously, if we're a vampire... Those parrots are chasing the chicken. That's fantastic. <laughs> uh, if we went outside, then we would burn, and that would be terrible. Another one. Vampires do not eat veggies. So I know you guys were really excited about the golden potatoes, but we are not doing golden potatoes in this series. Uh, but things like rotten flesh or meat or anything like that, perfect. Absolutely perfect. Uh, we might throw a couple of more rules in as we go. Uh, as I think of them, but those are the main ones that we're going to start off with. Before I do anything else, though, I've got to get underground. All right, so we've got our first really hairy moment. <laughs> I had to go a little far away uh, from where we spawned in the jungle just because um, I wanted to be close to a village. Uh, the reasons for that will show up by themselves at some point. So uh, this is already really hairy. <laughs> it's really bad, but technically right now, we're in the game. The game is on, right? Oh, geez. Nope, 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 nope. Get away. Get away. <laughs> well, I'm low on food, uh, which means I'm going to be low on health if I get hit. And it's nighttime. So, oh, goodness gracious. I hear, I hear a, uh, a drown near me. Oh, this is terrible, guys. This is such a terrible spot. But that's the whole purpose of this thing, right? Um, let's get him going over there. I want to stay away from that skeleton and the spiders. But I do want to find a cave, like, as soon as possible. Preferably with some dirt around it that I can run into. Get away from me. Get away from me. I see creepers. I see everybody. This is not a good way to start out <laughs> on a... Uh, on a hardcore world for sure because everything around me really 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 wants to kill me so the village is up there again i do want to be kind of close because i want to make that village kind of my um the place where i'll go on little raids and stuff like that does that make sense okay so we're looking for a nice cave just to call our home now i would say so we could make it through the night, but the night is really the only time that we can come out here, out into the overworld. Get away, get away. I see creepers. Oh, goodness. Getting too far away from that cave, guys. See what's over here, up on the top of the hill. be really nice if we saw a cave. That, oh. Of weird okay let me get some dirt while i'm here facing me i want to get some dirt so that when i do find a cave i'm able to uh kind of block myself in okay so got a little bit of dirt there's a zombie he's going for me i'm not worried about him what i'm worried about is the skeletons skeletons have that ranged weapon that's uh not very fun when you're playing hardcore and yeah, okay, am I being a little bit risky in all of this? Of course I am. Of course I am. You don't have to tell me. Believe me. Oh, bad way. Please don't be following me, skeleton. Yikes, 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 he's getting me, he's getting me. Don't die, please don't die. I haven't even really gotten started yet. We need to, we need to do something. Uh, and I can't go out in the sun, so it's not even like I can hang out in a cave. Okay. 
Yeah, now we're talking. Now, if I can find a cave over here, that would be fantastic. Mm. Ooh, star cave. They're all like these water caves. I guess it's fine. Okay. So let's uh let's find a place to kind of hang out down here. Um, and what I'm gonna have to do. So in case you didn't notice, another thing about this series is since you can't sleep through the night, that means that you have to hang out low grounds. Uh, oh, there's gonna be a creeper that falls on me. I know it. I need to hang out down here during the day. Um, right now, I am dangerously low on food. Obvious. What are our options, guys? What are our options? Okay, so uh, we've got a village that's nice. We're not really at a place, or I don't think we're at a place where we can explore that village. But I need some food bad. And I also need some wood. I probably need wood more than food. See if we can go up here. Please say no skeletons. Okay. So far, so good. Take this tree. Good. Good. Still clear. Second piece of wood. Good. Because even though we're vampires, we're still going to need tools, right? I'm not using any mods uh, to kind of enhance this whole story thing that we're doing here. Uh, we're just gonna we're just gonna make it go. Okay, good. I've got wood. I like this. I like this bay over here. I don't like that creeper over there. <laughs> Okay, so I think this is going to be it. I think this area right here is going to be at least where we start off with. Uh, I like it because there's plenty of um, there's water. So if mobs try to get me, I can just hop in the water real quick. That's really good. What would be really neat is if we had fish swimming around right here, like some trout or something. And that would make the world a good place. Okay, let me play around in here, see if I can find a good spot to set up shop, and then uh, I'll get back with you. All right, so a little bit of an update, guys. Guys, uh, So I was able to do a little bit of mining. As you can see, I found some coal down over there. So I basically mined through the day, which was fantastic. I did find some iron, which worked out really well as well. Um, and with that, I made myself a shield. I figured that would be important. I've also got a stone axe. And, uh, ugh, geez, even though it's not, it's nighttime now, we've got to capitalize this on this. And we've only got two, um, little chicken legs for, for hunger. So we've got to, we've got to try to remedy that really quickly. We've got to come out here and essentially not get hit by any mobs, especially that spider, <laughs> um, and get something for food because otherwise we are going to be hurting. I hear Skeleton. Okay. What I need is these guys. Come here. Come here. No, oh, no. Uh, gotcha. And uh, gotcha. Uh. Okay, so that's some food. And by the way, I don't think I talked about it before, but one of those other things, that little limitations that I'm giving myself. Ooh, that'll be actually come in handy is I'm not allowed to trade with villagers either. Because they're the enemy, right? They're the humans. So scary. I've got to find some other food over there. Save me. Save me. Thank you. <laughs> oh, good.
Very scary, guys. Out these houses. Eventually, I'm going to come back and kill you, probably. We can do it, though. We can do this. After these two cows, taken off back to our little cave, and then that's, we're probably going to call it a night, right? Okay, ready guys? Get back to our hole, hook up this food. Okay, we're safe. We are safe. Ah, oh, goodness gracious. Can't believe we made it. Okay, so I have no coal. Coal over there, but I'm worried. I don't think we have much of a choice. So let's hold out a couple. Oh, there's a hole right there. That'll help a lot. Come on. We don't have much time before it's day again. Block this off. That. All right, I've got some of the meat, guys. There's more cooking. Let's see if this uh, this is enough to fill us up. Uh, I probably just wasted one there, but that's going to give us a ton of saturation. And just look at that. Just like that, we're all the way back up. Okay, let's get back to, I guess let's get back to mining. Got four more torches left, so we may as well use them. Okay, guys, it's still daytime, but I really need to get some more coal so that I can do something with uh, this iron that I've mined. Let's, uh, let's make our way across, and I'm going to try to pillar up. Running low on durability. My pickaxe. Good. Oh, there's more. So worried about this pickaxe. And even more. Nice. Okay. So uh, let's leave that for now. Let's get some of this, um, some of that iron cooking so that we can start to make ourselves just a little bit stronger. I've got to watch out for that sunlight. <laughs> I don't want to want to accidentally go into it okay so I think I put it in this one there we go get this cooking
Guys, I don't know. I know we've been having fun so far in this episode, but I'm just not feeling right. Something I don't know. I don't know what it is. I, I know I can't go out in the sunlight. And, you know, I'm trying not to die, but I don't know. Something's just strange. It's storming outside. I'm starting to feel an urge. Go out. Visit that village again. Got seven iron. It'll be good for mining. Got a couple of coal left. We can make more torches if we needed to. Just not sure how I'm feeling right now. I'll see you guys next time.